Let's take a look at how you'll log in to epiced.online and your Study Island learning path. Number one, go to epiced.online. Number two, click on the plus sign at the top of your web browser to open a new window. Step three, in the new tab, log in to your Study Island account. Now that you're logged in, go to the left-hand menu and click on My Classes. Now click View Assignments and go to either Reading or Math, then click Continue. Now look for the corresponding title. Um, the title is on the left-hand side and the grade level is on the right-hand side. So this student, for example, is ready to work on division. Um, it's the letter B where it says division. And if she looks over to the right there, it says 5.n.1.2, and that's a fifth grade standard. Now you're ready to toggle back over to the epiced.online website. And on the home screen, uh, you'll about midway through, you'll see a circle. Click on the blue circle that says OAS Alignments. Now you'll want to click on the corresponding subject and grade level that matches uh, the learning path in Study Island. So this student was going to work on fifth grade division, so in the math column, she'll click on fifth grade. Scroll down and find the title that matches your Study Island title. For example, this student was working on division, so she'll scroll down and find division. The first column is the name of the Study Island topic, and there's a link um, to homework help there too. The second column contains practice questions from IXL. If you don't have an IXL account, you can still um, complete 15 questions per day. And the third column contains Khan Academy videos and practice questions. The fourth column contains additional instructional videos. Watch those carefully and take notes. Once you've worked your way through the lessons, through the videos, and the practice questions in IXL and Khan Academy, return to your Study Island tab. Now you can study the flashcards, review the lesson in Study Island, and play a game before you take your quiz.